fuck over with me, folks. No, he didn't back up. Yeah, he ain't pulled me the fuck over. What the fuck he pulled? Me? Yeah, get the fuck on. Um, oh, I know where it is. I got the right hand. Oh, okay. Yeah, she said, girlfriend, you have a good day. She trying to find her Gucci glasses that they find. AJ, stop looking back. Yeah, because that's not helping. I act like they ain't even there. I'm picking up my paper. I had I don't want y'all to get me for littering. So we're just laughing and kicking everywhere. What did I do with the phone? Are you the supervisor? Yes, ma'am, I am. Sir, your people have been following us all week. I have footage earlier of them following us early, down there this morning. You said they've been following you? You sure it was, sure was helpful? Not these you? specific faces, but your officers. They have been following us all week. I have footage from there at that gas station. Right. Um, I have footage from down here. Right. Matter of fact, even last week. I don't know what's going on and this is what I'm trying to figure out is what's going on because as soon as your officer came up to the van He put handcuffs on him for what? Okay, all right. I, I don't I don't know why I don't know who there been following has you. Well, let, let me explain to you. I don't know who's been following you I, I, I don't know why but the reason why he was stopped he committed a traffic infraction So at that point once he's committed a traffic infraction the deputy advises him as to what's going on which he did at that point, he asked for license, registration, proof of insurance, and state law says that we have the ability when we when a, a lawful traffic stop has been conducted, we can ask everybody. Let me finish. We can ask everybody to identify themselves. That's the law. It's not. It's not like we just making this stuff up. That's 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 what it is. So, and the main purpose is to them wanting to know who you are, and if you have a valid driver's license, it's because you, somebody's got to drive a van. If nobody drives a van. Then we got to tow it, and who wants who wants to pay impound fees when it's not necessary? So that's the whole that's the whole reason why they're mainly trying to identify everybody. In the he van. said running a stop sign because he followed us through from the entrance over there on Progress Village, right. through the village, and then out. We seen him speed up to get to 78 before we turn. My heat just willingly pulled over because he was three cars behind us. He willingly pulled over, and then here he comes pulling behind us. So if he was gonna stop us, he should have stopped us back there. He followed us. I have, I recorded him following us. He even waved. Well, here, here, here's the thing. He made that up. We did not stop. There was no injured party. There was nothing. This is harassment. Right. And I really would like everybody's names and badge numbers That's so I can we, file we, a report. Everybody yeah. who's involved in this stop. Well, let, let me let me let me just explain something to you. I understand you're saying that he followed you for a ways, but here's the thing. If I let's just hypothetically say. 
we on Highway 60, right? Adamo Drive. And let's just say I see you commit a traffic infraction. Nothing says I have to stop you right there on Adamo Drive. No, nothing says I could follow you all the way to 7th Street if I want to. That's harassment. Ma'am, it's not harassment if you commit a traffic infraction. That's what I'm saying. If you, if you, let's just say you ran the light on Adamo and let's just say Falkenberg, right? And I see you run the light. You committed a traffic infraction. Let me finish. I can follow you all the way here. And I can and I can stop you here for the a traffic infraction that you committed on Animal Drive which, in Falkenberg. What traffic infraction are these? Because to my recollection and to my knowledge, all law enforcement take oath to the Constitution, correct? Right. Does everybody have their oath of office? You should carry. Take, no, no, oath of office is no. When we're, ma'am, listen. When we're sworn, I'm listening. When we're sworn in. That's our oath of office. We don't we don't carry a card. We don't let, let me tell you something before I I know where this is going. And I'm very familiar. No, with no, it. please, I, please I, do I, not I, label I, us like I, that. I, please I, no, don't. Listen, listen ma'am. I'm not labeling mm -mm. anybody. What I'm saying is because I know where you're going with that. What, mm -mm. I'm, what, I'm, what I'm saying is I, I see the documents that the deputy was provided. I, I I don't know what else to tell you. All I can tell you is what what what's factual. This is not legitimate. It's not. Now, if you want to argue that, you you welcome to go to court and argue. But we're not gonna hold court out here today. All I can tell you is this. My deputy said that your husband he didn't come to a stop. That's and and he that was him an over. excuse. Well, ma'am, I after fo after following us and harassing. There's nowhere in the Constitution does it state anything about traffic infraction. You guys are for us, and if you guys are for us, why do we feel so scared and intimidated? Well, ma'am, ma'am, listen, I, I I can't I can't attest as to what's in the Constitution. All I can tell you is if you took what, oath to what, it. What, this is what I'm saying. I can only tell you. What the sheriff's office is paying us to do. They're paying us to do a job, and part of that job is it's to enforce. This is what I'm saying: is to enforce the, the laws and the traffic laws in the state of Florida. That's it. That's it. Now, if you have a problem with that as to how things are being uh, uh, conducted, then that's something you need to take up with a higher. A we higher go to city council meetings and all that because right. we know what's going on. And then I call the non-emergency number, and I'm right. telling, I'm asking for a supervisor. Right. I call to request you because right. I'm scared. Right. He's yelling at me, telling me to get back. You see how little I am? What can I do? I'm scared. And then he's talking to my sons. Right. They're asking them for IDs. You can clearly tell he's a baby. He's right. not even old enough to go anywhere by himself. Right. Well, so I'm minor don't have ID. Just why you tell the devil he's. 15, we did, 15. but listen. And like I stated, I have seen too many of my men throughout the United States getting shot down. And I like the guy over the phone said it has not happened in Hillsborough County. I don't know. But the image that is just ingrained in my head right. from that I watch on the six o'clock news, nine o'clock is people and officers that's supposed to be here to protect us, killing people over traffic infractions. So you guys, Mr. Dixon, you have to understand how I as a woman well, feel, I, I just, my husband and, and my it. sons. And, and ma'am, I perfectly understand that. I, I, I don't mean, think but, so because- but here's the thing though, so my thing of the matter is, is this. It, it's, it, it's as simple as this. If, if, he, if, he, if he ran the stop sign, hey, this is my name. And let me just break it down to you. Hey, this is my name. If I have a driver's license off, I don't. It's neither here nor there. You either got one or you don't. If you don't have one, say, hey, man, I don't have a driver's license. I run to people like that all the time. License is suspended. And, and we handle it appropriately. Don't necessarily mean somebody going to jail. You just get a ticket. Who knows how we can handle this? But when you start, when you when you get a paperwork like this that we obviously can't do anything with, it, it just, it, it spins out of control. Can I ask a question? Sure. We have, there. there's amendments to the Constitution, right? We have freedom of speech. We have the right to travel. We have natural born rights to do right. anything we want, right? Without right. being hindered or molested. But the problem is, is that you might have natural born rights, but here's the problem. In the state of Florida, you you. We're on the United States. Well, well, I'm sorry. We're in America. Right, but ma'am, I, I I get I, I hear you. But the problem is, is that in the state of Florida, they have rules. It's like if you work at the Walmart, right? Walmart got rules. The sheriff's office got rules. They have the policies Florida, and codes. They have. Well, you know what? But guess what? That's a, if you look at the Webster's dictionary. That's another name for a rule. I policies study all that and the Black's Law dictionary. Right. So that's still just another name for a rule. Policies and procedures. I call them rules, you call them policies and procedures, or vice versa. Mr. Dixon, I know you have a job to do because you're in uniform. And of course, everybody's going to say, yes, I understand. But you're not going to understand because you don't have a husband nor a son. I right. don't know if you have sons. Right. but I have a son. Okay. My son's grown. He's in the military. So, <laughs> Ma'am, the, the fact of the matter is, if, 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 if he ran the stop sign and he don't have a license, okay, he don't have a license. 
that, that's what it is. You know what? You don't have It's a not license. even that. It's the okay. harassment for the last week and a well, half. I can't, att I, can't att I, I can assure you that these ones didn't fall in. No, I'm not saying those specific but, faces. But, I'm speaking of the Hillsborough gotta, County I, I car in but uniform. Ma'am, ma here's the thing, though. So if I go to Walmart and I have a problem with a cash at the Walmart in Gibsonton, am I, am I just going to say all Walmarts are bad? No. And that's what you're doing. You are generalizing. You're stereotyping. Okay, maybe that's maybe, what's done to let, us, let me, let me, let me, ma'am. Let me tell you something. I, I was I was born this color. I and, know, and, and, and it, that's what it is. So believe my, me, they, believe me. I know, they, I, I they, I a police told my husband one time, "Don't be out here scaring people on the beach." How is he scaring people? I, Just he naturally listen, looks but, like that. But listen. I don't know who that police officer is. I'm just they, letting you know. You, you can't judge every police officer based on the few that you run into. You're right, but unfortunately, it but, happens because we're judged as right. well, and we shouldn't be. Well, man, let me tell you something. I done seen a whole bunch of po police officers get, get shot, too. So it go, it, it happens to us, too, now. I get what you're saying, you know, but still. But here's the thing. The, how are we going to resolve this right now? We need to resolve this because you got you know, you know got people in the car. It's hot out here. I'm just trying to resolve it the best way possible. The problem is... if. I don't I don't know what the, the status is of your husband. I don't know if he got a license or not. I, I don't know. I, I don't know that. But what I'm trying to do is is to try to prevent you from incurring more fees. Because what's gonna happen is if we cannot get if you don't have if we can't verify you got a driver's license or not, we have to impound the vehicle. We don't have a choice because we cannot release we'll it if you don't have a driver's license. That's just what it is. I mean, because you can't drive on the roads without a, a valid driver's license. Listen. Cause this it this cannot be impounded. Here's my license. They told. Mm. Is it valid? Is it good? Is it straight? I mean, yeah, I've never had anything on me. Nothing. So so my was, tags is. So what was so difficult? There's about no the difficult. The, the thing is the principal. First, we've been followed. He followed us throughout the village right. and then said we ran a stop sign. Right. That's why we have to stand our grounds as at the end of and the I'll day, talk, outside and of and the I'll uniform, them, we're all humans and, and, ask, and we and have I'll rights. Them, and I'll talk to them and I ask them, hey, where do they run to stop? I have no problem going there. You guys the have thing. cameras at the front, I hope, right? That's no, on all the time. Un unfortunately, we don't, we don't have cameras. Nor body cams. No, that's dangerous. That's why I record. Right. Yeah, it's dangerous for us too. It goes both Which ways. Which is why right? I, I, we you stay know, recording. But, we don't we just there's something they haven't issued us yet so you know um like i said you know it, it, i'll go talk to him and see but like i said we don't you got to understand that nothing says that if he see if he see a, a traffic infraction committed a mile away nothing says he has a no right he was there. talking about this stop sign right there right, right. when we are coming out onto 70th i don't know what that street is but right when you come in he right. said we ran that stop sign but he came he turned he started following us where that park is on progress village that's where right. he, when we turned in he turned in okay. my husband pulled over off to the side let one car go no he went through and then another car went through right. he was on his computer then 